Hello, I'm Kisune Zeta, and welcome back to Whiplash. Now, last time we completed the Gremlin Cup, and with it we actually unlocked a couple things. Not the least of which being the second cup of the game, the Premier Cup. Now, with it we also unlocked the Advanced Car Set, which we will be using for the Premier Cup. And as usual, we'll be doing a time trial, followed by the actual cup. Now, you'll notice the colors are a bit different than before. That's because the advanced cars use a different palette to distinguish them from the standard set. They also have improved stats all around the board, so races will probably be a little tighter. The Reaper. A rapid, viciously curving track whose fiendish bends favor a driver with no respect for his own life or yours. So, while the first track of the Gremlin Cup was, was pretty much easy, the second cup, oops, first track, can actually harm you. With that, you having to run through walls. As you can tell, you will get launched. This is also why I do a warm up. The Reaper is definitely your wake up call, because this is still one of the easier tracks. Pit is still on the right in this port part of the course. Incidentally, the uh, the uh, championship finale sequence take occurs on this track. So if this area around the starting line seems a bit familiar, that's why. As it is, I've already managed to really hurt myself. Because you'll notice I'm hitting like 200 miles per hour. The advanced set cars are legitimately faster than the standard set. Are legitimately better. Yeah, other than that, there's not really a lot to speak of for this one. I'm going to be using the same set of AI racer names for this, this championship as well, so those that have learned those... Yeah, you're not going to have to relearn any driver names. I do plan on changing it up for... on uh, changing it up later. I am legitimately curious if it's possible to flip yourself on this track. But yeah. All in all, you just gotta learn and where to control your speed on this course. Done 
Congratulations, you're a winner! Race over! So with that, let's, let's switch over to championship. Now, since this is the first course, we don't need to reload a game, so let's get started. 15 laps on the Reaper. Drivers ready! Engines ready! Go! So you may have noticed that the music is different. I'm using the MIDI a audio tri audio for the uh, Whoa, for the music this time as opposed to the CD audio I'm actually more used to the MIDI audio than CD audio because I actually wasn't aware I also just realized that I passed up someone that was flipped so that actually answers that question But uh, yeah, I'm actually more f uh, familiar with the uh, with the MIDI audio than the CD audio. And there are people that will argue, oh, oh this this soundtrack sounds bad. Sir, I flipped. Okay. Yeah, great. And I'm good. I'm gonna get wrecked, aren't I? Yeah, I might be off to a bad start, considering that I that uh, considering that in the uh, Gremlin Cup I never once got had, uh, received a fatality, caused a few, but I was never the recipient of one. Uh, first race of the Premier Cup. I uh, get a fatality. That tells you what the that tells you what to expect. Keep going. Keep going. Yeah, I I do not expect it to place well on this, this on this race. Yeah. Screw it. Backtrack to the pit. Yeah. Let's see. So, this is probably going to date the recording a bit, if nothing else does. But, okay, you're only a lap behind. Keep going. as I'm recording this, all eight of the, uh, all, all eight of the full rap, all eight of the full rap, sorry. All eight of the full race uh, videos have been queued up and scheduled for release, and as of right now, I believe the third. Mobile eight to car seven. I got a few guys out here who need a lesson. I'm taking them out. 
and as of right now the okay if I could stop getting interrupted the third full race video has been published as of two days before this recording out of neutrals but it's Keep not going. often you'll, uh, you'll hear that line when I'm playing so I'm not sure if it is a genuine placebo effect but I find if you're able to uh, lower your uh, speed a bit when you land or at least the speedometer Uh, find if you're able to lower your speedometer a bit. It's yeah, give him some. Okay, you're only a lap behind. Keep going. But uh, lowering your speedometer generally lowers the amount of damage you take upon landing. Keep going. At least from my experience. Of course, it could be entirely placebo effect. Suck. Okay, up shift fast. Because I want to get as fast as I can going, and I need to get into that pit uh, repair. Head for the pits. Okay, it looks like there's a couple of people trying to pit. Take that easy kill. Five laps remaining. Yeah. Yeah, give him some. Oh, eight to car seven. I'm out. Okay, 
Yeah, denying other cars the opportunity to pit is a viable tactic. So this is the most kills I've gotten in a single race in a long time. I made it to the final lap. all around. Let's see how many people actually finished. <laughs> so I tired with Shikiaki for kills. You know, I actually did got more points than Suwako who's in fourth place. That's because I got at all those kills. So with that, I'm actually in fourth place, and not too far, but not too far behind uh, second place. Uh, Shikiaki and Remu are actually tied. Now again, that doesn't really matter because I'm aiming for first, but this is still a good spot considering how this how this race started. And there's the team table. 
31 casualties. And this is only the first race of the cup. But next time, the free fall. But I do need to actually uh, save this. Save, save. And next time, the free fall. <laughs>